Hi, welcome to I Am The Light. My name is Tasha and I'll be doing a reading for the sign of Leo. Hey, Leo placements. If you are new here, welcome. And if you are returning, welcome back, baby. What's up? What's up? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Um, Y'all came in at number seven on the viewer list. I'm going, I got a list going down the list based on views. Y'all hit it up at number seven. Y'all tied with Virgo around 62, I think. Y'all both had either 61 or 60 views or something like that. I don't know. Don't give me the line. But anyway, let's get into it. Um, Spirit guides, ancestors, great divine creator. I ask for clear, honest messages on behalf of Leo. Sun, moon, Venus rising, Leo. What is it that Leo needs to know at this time, Spirit? Sun, moon, and Venus rising, clear, honest messages. I thank you. Um, Ashe. How y'all doing? <laughs> Your girl has been busy, 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 busy. But y'all will be the fifth reading I did today. So I did, let me think, I think I did five, one, two, three, four. No, y'all are fourth, fourth reading. So I did four readings. This will be four readings. That's not bad. Then I got four more to go. Okay, not too bad. That's not too bad. I did not mean to do that. All right. So let's see what your spirit got for you. We're going into the tea leaf oracle, y'all. Because <clears throat> spirit has been giving predictions. Or just talking about the current energy. And then um, we've been trying to get new love. But a lot of people's new love has been a past love trying to come back. Y'all probably ain't going to be no different. So, But when we get to the characteristics date, that's when you're going to see characteristics of your new person. Okay? Versus your old person. Then we're going to do Kipperish Indian money. Okay? Oh, tarot is after uh, this here. <laughs> okay, she's like, when is tarot going to be in here? Right after this, baby. Right after this. All right, let me finish shuffling. Every day I'm hustling, hustling, hustling. <laughs> Every day I'm hustling, hustling. Why am I seeing Cat Williams when he was on stage and they played that music for him? That's what I'm hearing. And he got to do on that dance. <laughs> Leo, some of y'all might be chasing a bag right now. Might be. All right, Spirit, what you got for Leo? Sun, moon, Venus rising. What you got for them? What you got for Leo? That's a lot. Uh, give me two more. What you got? Okay, thank you. All right, y'all got yoke. You might feel tied down and frustrated at this time. Staff, you will be taken care of during difficult times. Frying pan, troubled, trouble accusations may might be significant. Firecracker, excitement, explosion. Woo! Some gonna be set off. Fly. A period of ill health and depression. And then you got turkey. Someone is behaving stupidly. Oh. All right. Let's talk about a spirit. What you got for yoke? Clarify yoke for Virgo. Oh, sorry. Leo. I apologize, y'all. I just got done doing Virgo. Spirit. Clarify yoke for Leo. What you got for yoke for Leo? Will, indecisiveness, allow your life to ramble aimlessly. If you ain't got no direction, you're going to feel tired down and frustrated. Somebody is already trying to bind you. Then you can't make no decision. You ain't going to get nowhere fast like that. It says, arrow, you're on the right path regarding some aspect, though, of your life. Handshake, a meeting with a stranger could be important. So y'all might be getting ready to meet a, a stranger. You're on the right path. You just need to make a decision, okay? Staff. Spirit, clarify staff for uh, Leo. What does staff mean? Clarify staff. A. Success is assured with good plans and hard work. So it says you're going to be taken care of in difficult times. Probably because you're doing some, uh, you got good plans and hard work. Y'all have 
Money path. You're on a path of money. It's just waiting for you to find it. Rainbow. The most difficult part of a situation is about to be over. See? You're going to be taken care of during difficult times. It, the most difficult part is almost, it says it's over. You just got to follow the rainbow. When you follow the path, it leads to money. It's waiting for you to find it. Success is assured with good plans and hard work. You're going to win, baby. Clarify frying pan. Troubled accusations. Clarify frying pan for me, please, spirit. Frying pan is clarified by pig. Beware of greed. Troubled accusations. Vine. Seek out information that will help you. Somebody's accusing you of something, and this person might be greedy. Door. Opportunities are waiting for you. So you need to seek out information that's going to help you. Somebody, though, that's greedy is going to try to accuse you of something. Okay. What? Okay. Uh, Spirit, can you tell me what they're trying to accuse uh, Leo of? What is it that they're trying to accuse Leo of? What are they trying to accuse Leo of? Ooh. A journey, physical or mental, it's time to go and have fun. Maybe they're going to accuse you of being greedy and checking out mentally or physically because you it's like it's time for you to go on vacation or something. It's time for you to go out and have fun, but you got a lot of new opportunities and people trying to help you. I don't know. What's going on in May for Leo? What's, what's this May? Maybe something happened this past May or something good is coming in May. Pale. It's time to get out of a situation. Scales. You need to keep your life in balance. Dog advice from a friend. So in the month of May, you need to stay balanced by taking advice from a friend. And you got just enough time to get out of a situation if you're not happy. Firecracker. Excitement. Spirit, what's coming up with firecracker? Why is firecracker out here? Clarify firecracker. A dark woman. Could be of significance, dealings, or a relationship with a woman with dark complexion or skin. Wedge, somebody is trying to come between you and a friend or something that, that you want. Tower, solid foundation and success with effort. So somebody's getting ready to undergo, undergo a tower. It's going to be success though. This is a positive tower. And somebody has been trying to get in the way of you having this positive tower that's going to lead to a lot of uh, excitement. It's a it's a dark-skinned woman doing this. Clarify uh, fly or a woman with dark hair. Spirit, clarify fly, a period of ill health. This ill health, um, it might have kicked off in the month of September. It says you're waiting for news or a package or letter. So y'all might be waiting on receiving a precious gift. You're receiving a precious gift with diamond. So somebody's just been waiting, I guess, to hear that things are better with their health. That's going to make them feel like riches. I know that. Clarify turkey. Someone is behaving stupidly. Clarify turkey. Turkey is clarified by flag. Do not be tempted to lower your standards. So when somebody acts dumb, they go low, you go high. Dog, protection from a powerful friend. Some of y'all are being protected by a powerful friend. You may or may not know. Gong, something excited. Somebody's going to act stupid around you getting a brand new something. But pay that no, never mind. All right, let's get into love, Leo. I drink all of this. Nope. Y'all, the light be hurting my eyes, so I don't look up as much in the evening. I thought about cutting it off. Let me see if I can cut it down just a little bit more. Right there. Ooh, that's even better. Yes. I love that. Right there. It's probably on one percent, honey, because I do not like a lot of light. It it burns my eyes. I don't know what that is about me at night. Probably because I want to be seeing the back of these eyelids. Because <laughs> I know to go to bed early, honey. 
But we got just enough time to do one more reading and get it uploaded before I go to bed. And this will put me where I can still get up at 3 if I, you know. All right, Spirit, what you got for Leo? Y'all starting off with the Six of Wands in reverse. The Queen of Pentacles upright. The Six of Swords in reverse. Five of Swords in reverse and the Knight of Swords upright. Somebody quickly wants to come back towards you and apologize. They do. And the reason why they want to apologize to you is they know that they didn't pay you attention. And you were somebody who really looked out for them. So they want to come back and apologize for ignoring you when you was a person that looked out for them. They want to come in quick too. Clarify the Six of Wands. Why didn't they pay attention to Leo? Clarify the Six of Wands. So somebody with the Magician upright, the Seven of Cups in reverse, and the Seven of Pentacles. This person did not give you a lot of attention because and things move slow with them because they you weren't their only option. Somebody, somebody um, with the Magician, they like to be manipulative. They like other options. I don't know if y'all can see, but you can almost see through her dress almost. Somebody likes ladies. They like to get around, so they weren't your only, they were not the only option here. So things with you and this person was growing slow and they could not give you a lot of attention because they was too busy entertaining third parties. Clarify Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles would be any earth sign, but heavier on the cap. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles. This Queen of Pentacles, she looked out. So clarify that spirit. Clarify Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles is clarified by the Four of Cups upright, the Two of Pentacles up, excuse me, Four of Cups in reverse, Two of Pentacles in reverse with the Hangman upright. So after taking some time to think, this person has decided that they know that they have been, you know, they don't want to juggle anymore. They don't want to juggle you, not, you know, or ghost you because like now they're ready to get up and do something about it. They're ready to get up off their derriere and do something about it because they don't want to be juggling with you anymore. Clarify the six of swords in reverse. Death reverse. Somebody really wants to come back. Death reverse. Six of swords reverse. Yeah, they want to let go. they want to help you let go of burdens. Cause they see you out here independent. You out here by yourself doing the damn thing. So they want to come back and to relieve burdens. Now I don't know if they want you to relieve their burdens, because this could sound like this could be a deadbeat, huh? Clarify the five of swords in reverse. Somebody wants to come in and apologize. But why? What did they do? What did they do? Let me see if I change this. Ooh, even better, honey. Yes. Let me see if I do. Ooh, even better. That might not be what y'all like, but honey, I love it. Right there. Right there. That's the right ambiance for me. <laughs> Clarify the five of swords in reverse. I ain't lying to them. My eyes feel better. Clarify the five of swords in reverse. Y'all might not like it. I don't know how, how it's going to show on camera, but we'll see. King of Wands. So, oh, somebody wants to come back because they're now. They, it's like somebody has what they call shiny object syndrome. You are the next best thing. You are what they want to return back to and they want to apologize. Yeah, after this ending. They didn't want to give you a, pit, a pinnacle and they ended things. Now you are the next best option. So they want to come hot tail their ass back to you with a quickness. There's something about you makes you the next best option. So when the going gets tough, this person gets going. So they go for whoever has the, ne the next best thing. And right now that's you. Eight of Wands. So this person wants to come in with fast communication, but they blocked. You got them blocked. But they want to come in fast, but they blocked. With the eight of sword, eight of wands in reverse. Excuse me. Page of Pentacles in reverse. The star in reverse. Eight of cups. So yeah, somebody wants to come in and rush towards you, but they feel like it's hopeless because they don't have everything they need to really get this off the ground with you, Empress. Yeah. 
Anything else, Spirit? Let me get five more cards for uh, Leo. Anything else? Anything else for Leo? Y'all got the Page of Cups upright, the Fool upright, the Two of Wands upright, the Judgment upright, and the Page of Wands. Told you somebody wants to get this off the ground. They want you to give them mercy after the ending. They want you to give them an extended hand. They want to redo the relationship. I know that's not your plan, though, no, because you're the Nine of Pentacles. Your plan, your plan is not to go towards nothing like this. You just want to be single and out here doing your own thing with the Nine of Pentacles. You cool doing you, boo-boo. You relieve burdens by yourself. So it's like, why do I need to... What? Yeah, but somebody is doing spell work trying to manifest you. They, 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 they see themselves as, uh, I guess, a page of cups. Somebody very emotionally immature. But yeah, this person definitely does want to come back. After having you in third party situations, now they want to act like, listen, they might do anything it takes to get you back. Because the King of Swords is in reverse, Leo. So that means they might say or do anything. Will of Fortune upright. Five of Cups upright. Seven of Wands. So you're trying to block off anybody that has you mourning. Or just going to you know, have you in regret or even heartbreak. It's like you're making head over heart decisions. It's like, no, nah, I need to continue to block this because you're just going to lead me to crying, upset, heartbreak. You want to return for what? You're still not emotionally available for what? Okay. This person wants to come in and tell you their secrets about the third parties and them just up and leaving. They want to tell you about why they just up and leave and now why they want to come back and be play nice. Now they want to come back and play nice. After being out here with third parties, now they want to talk about some of these secrets. They want to release some of the secrets they, they've been keeping behind your back about these third parties. They want to talk about it now. But it looks like you're blocking any and all communication with the Seven of Wands in reverse. Yeah, this is causing a tower for this person here. Yeah, because they wanted to come in and offer love. So it's like now, it's like somebody is communicating for real, for real, that they cool by themselves. They cool by themselves. They don't need any offers. Offers just lead to the tower. And then they end up unhappy. Yeah, you want this person is going to release this because they're not happy. They're not happy. Did something else come out? I thought it no. Oh, it flipped. Yeah, it did. Yeah, somebody wants to come back when things are not toxic. Because it still sounds like it's still some toxic behaviors or something going on here. Clarify the high priestess in reverse. Yeah, somebody wants to come towards you with a love offer, but you're not going to accept it with the two of cups in reverse. Yeah, you feel like what's over is over. It ain't no point in coming out the cold. They didn't want it. They didn't want it. Hmm. But now they want to come out the cold. Hmm. All right, Spirit, what else you got for Leo? Yeah, you don't feel like you... Okay, some of y'all feel like this person ain't no point in going to counseling. Uh, if they're not giving no equal give and take, I'm going to just leave my boundaries up. We're just going to end up arguing and I ain't in the mood for it. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody left a lucrative situation to go towards a... Um, what did I say? They, they went towards the um, Ten of swords in reverse so they want to take the all the all the knives out of your back that they did yeah buddy somebody wants because right now they feel trapped this tower is making somebody feel trapped temperance reverse like things are out of balance and so now all they do is think about how they want to commit to you but they were sneaking around with that seven of swords somebody was on some manipulative sneaking in the middle of the night in and out of windows and type shit this person that you already know this person really don't love you no, they stay stressed out. They stay stressed out with nine of swords. Stay stressed. They want to, um, somebody that didn't want to work with you, you're going to get a brand new emotional beginning 
Why? 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 Why do they get a brand new emotional beginning with the Ace of Cups? Because somebody came in and sabotaged it. Somebody wanted to sabotage you getting that Ace of Cups, Nine of Cups. That's that wish fulfillment that everything would dry up for you. Somebody did not want your blessings to come in. They wanted everything to dry up for you, and so they've been doing work to do that. Yeah, they see you out here strong and independent in your Leo energy. And honest to God, like now it's like they're looking at the facts. I mean, all the facts. Yeah, the moon is in reverse. And the eight of pentacles. Yeah, something here you're going to see just wasn't working with the way things are. You just not. Just wasn't working at all. All right, y'all, we're going to leave it there. Let's move on to um, characteristics of your new person. All right, let's get your characteristics. Spirit, what can you tell me about Leo's new person? Somebody's going to just pop up on you and just start talking to you. You might not see it coming. How my Siri just started talking out of the blue. So somebody might come up and start talking to you out the blue when you're least expecting it. Keep that in mind. All right, Spirit, what you got for... Um, Leo, what characteristics of a next person? What are the characteristics of Leo's next person in love? This person is very romantic and they are a workaholic, okay? Might even be in a nursing field or something where they got to wear a scrub. This person is not a big shoe fanatic, but they like shoes. Somebody likes shoes, but they don't have to necessarily be a big shoe fanatic. This person has curly hair, could have blonde highlights. This person has small breasts. This person is loyal and trustworthy. That, okay, so you want somebody who is loyal and trustworthy? You got it. This person sometimes wears glasses and they're trying to get over being stubborn. Somebody is a home body. Well, another person likes to work really hard with being a workaholic. Somebody is humorous. Somebody likes to laugh. Shallow, arrogant, and entitled. Somebody else is going to act like that. Pick up the shallow, er arrogant, entitled stuff. Lacking in size, but makes up for it in other areas. Somebody is street smart. Definitely like guns. Might own a gray suit or wear glasses. Somebody here has beautiful eyes and they like to travel. It says big, big energy is here upright weight moves fast somebody might like to drive faster hmm. somebody likes to move fast big big energy moves fast somebody could be dealing with an earth sign by the way Somebody has some unique physical traits like vitiligo, could have moles. Some, something about their appearance is different than other people's. Some of y'all could be dealing with a fire sign. Somebody could be uh, more than, uh, they got a little bit more than a little bit meat on their bones. It could be on the heftier side, a little thicker. Somebody likes to wear their hair natural with an afro and they might have a gap in their teeth, brown skin. Somebody has a very powerful yoni. I mean, yes, honey, it's like they can call down magic. It's electrifying. Somebody could have air in their chart. Somebody could be of caramel complexion, likes to get their nails done. Somebody has the gift of gab. Oh, 
y'all. Somebody is still trying to figure out their life goals and their dreams. Somebody is a public figure. Somebody is not the settling down type. Casanova. You got beautiful lips, though. They can talk a good game. You might have that wand energy. Somebody is bald or has dreads. They have might have blonde highlights. Somebody is 5'8 and shorter. Somebody could have a slight disability. This is somebody you already know. Somebody likes to have sex, sex, and more sex. While one person is controlling and controlling and jealous. Y'all forgive me. I, I it was like I looked down and I just feel like I blanked out for a half a second. I told you this is why I don't do no damn reads late. <laughs> Okay, somebody likes to smell really, really good. Somebody is not your usual type, though. Somebody is slim and petite. Somebody loves self-care. Somebody is an athlete. Somebody falls in love fast. Could have a pet. So, so hunt child, you'll be attracted to this person physically. I ain't even have sex in the kitchen. You'll like this person, honey. Spirit says this is not your type at all. The answer is no. Somebody has sway. At the bottom of the deck, somebody is very creative. They could have a piercing or a tattoo. They're not the best dressed. Somebody does, again, have natural skin, natural hair, might like a fro. Very nice teeth, though. Somebody has a very nice manicured beard. Short hair is in reverse, so they might have longer hair. Somebody has freckles. It could be a vegan. Young at heart, and somebody is hot maintenance. At the top of the deck, somebody is definitely packing. And they move, man, that man is packing, honey. Very athletic. Okay, who is this? Somebody is irresponsible and immature is in reverse. So you probably with somebody very, very responsible. Somebody, though, is slow to commit and they are very mysterious. Somebody has two small children at home and they might be spiritual and religious. All right, let's jump into the Kipperish. All right, Spirit, what you got for uh, the Kipperish there? When I split it open, real love abandonment. Somebody left behind a relationship that they used to think was real love. Somebody left it behind. Hmm. One more. Somebody gives false accusations about this person. That's what that's probably why y'all broke up. All right, Spirit, what do you have for Leo from the Kipperish deck? Somebody's doing death magic. I cannot. I hate when that comes out. In the dis distant future, they're going to continue to do it. Something about death magic in the distant future. Oh, Lord. Due to death magic, somebody's going to have a health concern in the very distant future. Somebody sent out death magic, and because they did, they're going to be having a health concern in the near future. This is somebody you was in a relationship with. But you're unbothered because this person acts childish. Sorry, y'all. I felt something under my foot. It was a card. Yeah, this is somebody you feel unbothered by. You feel like somebody here is childish. They have childish ways. Uh, change. You waiting on this person to change. Yeah, somebody is stuck in bondage. You feel like they're trying to bind you or bond, put you in bondage. Somebody wants to be the boss of you. They do not like that you are uh, that you have divinity. They want you to experience bad karma. They don't want you to be divine. They want you to be like them. <laughs> Look, awakening in reverse. So some of y'all might be going in, under awakening. They don't want you to. Whoever this past person is, they definitely don't like that. So they want you to be, I'm telling you, somebody does not. They want you to join the dark side, honey. Priestess in reverse, divinity in reverse, karma in reverse. And this person wants to bind you. They want to change you. They want to boss you up. They want to bind your hand and want you to shut the hell up. Because even they, they want to bound your mouth up. Somebody is mad because you can see beyond the veil. And you can see through people's bullshit with false in reverse. 
They don't like that. So this person has a Jezebel spirit on them and they like to send out a lot of flying monkeys. Anything else? Spirit. This person could be a mature man. They're going to be mad because that you're a rich girl. This person likes to abuse their power and they like to sit in a position. Yeah, they abuse their uh, spiritual gifts as priests. So they might be a high priest, but they like to uh, abuse their power to harm others. This person, you're going to take them to the courthouse. So it might be a, some sort of divorce or something here about court. Destruction. This person's going to cause a lot of destruction. They like to tear up a lot of stuff. Somebody's in their south node. So that means all they do is low vibrational shit. This is why they keep trying to pull strings and be manipulative. Spirit says, continue to hold your faith and move on from this, please. Ritual, somebody's doing magic on you. It could be a karmic female doing magic on you. Somebody is definitely in a lot of emotional pain. They have a lot of amnesty and hate on a sweetheart. Somebody that's sweet. Somebody is hating on a sweetheart with a lot of amnesty and pain. See? Sweetheart, amnesty, pain. Somebody is crazy. This person has a concern, poverty in reverse. Somebody wants some help. They're going to need some help. They can send you the evil eye. When I cut the deck, somebody is ascending. And they are definitely protected. Somebody's getting ready to go into that RIP. I told you. I'll be knowing. Somebody's going to go, die. They did something. Somebody's going to transition out and they are been blocked. Your ancestors is watching over you, baby. Somebody is definitely jealous and envious. They like they can't even pretend no more to be a nice guy. They mad. They don't want your star to rise, but they want to talk to you. I told you, message. Somebody is so for some of y'all, it's your twin flame that abandoned you. They traveled away from you. They didn't want the commitment, and now that you didn't let it go, now they want to talk. Child, please. <laughs> Child, please. All right, let's get your money message, Leo. Spirit, what do you got for money for Leo? What you got for Leo's money, Spirit? Somebody's been doing spell work or you need to. Using money spells or manifesting. You can use magic spells or your manifesting powers to so that they're strong. You can cast a spell to remove any kind of blockages and negative energies. Y'all better get down with that get down. Be wary of casting the wrong spell or someone giving you the evil eye. Because y'all got y'all are very inspiring. A lot of people see your light. You have a spark of inspiration that will ignite brilliant ideas. It's essential that you clear, be clear about what you want and follow your heart. Too many ideas are blocking you from making a, any idea into a reality. Self-made. Some of y'all are going to be self-made. You will become successful or rich by your own efforts. Sometimes you must be observed in order to be successful. You're under under utilizing your own strength and advantages business expect to have an amazing boost up in the business ladder you're going to either be an executive position ceo management or anything in the corporate world elevate your awareness and think bigger if you want different results so spirit is saying you, some of y'all need to get down with that spell works do some return to senders or you could cast your own spell to manifest some money Hmm. All right, that's it. That's all I got for you, Leo. Thank you all for joining me this evening on I Am The Light. It has definitely been a pleasure, honey. As always, thank you, thank you. If you're looking for a personal read, you can email me at I Am The Light 
tarot at gmail.com um everything you need to know will be in the description box y'all know i do collective reads every day during the week um one will be coming out i normally start to collect this on tuesday through saturday even if i have signed readings to do i always make sure the collective is taken care of collective readings go out before 8 a.m try to sometimes definitely before nine because it depends sometimes the uploads be so terrible y'all all right, that's it. That's all I have for you. Please hit the like, share, and subscribe. Leo, next time, I'll catch you on the next one. Okay? Bye, baby.